Hello my lovely angels, how are you guys doing? I hope you are fine and rocking as always. This is Sheetal Sipil Matri. Welcome to my channel. Today we are going to do a very interesting pick a card reading. The topic is what is going to be your milestone or what is going to be your achievement in the next six months. So whenever you see this video starting from that date to the next six months. So we have three options over here. Option number one is this beautiful chariot card from the Ethereal Visions Tarot deck. Thank you so much Jyoti for gifting this beautiful tarot deck to me. Option number two is this beautiful Six of Wands from the gold foil tarot and this is also gifted by Jyoti thank you so much and the third option is the world card from the light seers tarot so you can choose any option that you're drawn towards I also kept candles over here so for option number one the candle is pink color for option number two, the candle is a beautiful green color. And for option number three, the candle is an orange color. So you can select any option uh, with regards to the color of the candle or the tarot card. Uh, in case if you're like, you know, Sheetal, can I choose this, uh, you know, why am I date of birth? Then let me just shuffle the date of birth, close my eyes and I'll allocate date of birth to each pile. Alright, pile 1, pile 2 and pile 3. Okay, so let's see what are the piles. For pile 1, the date of birth that has been chosen is 21 to 31. So any of these date of birth. For pile 2, the date of birth is 11 to 20. So any of these date of birth. And for pile 3, the date of birth is 1 to 10. Any of these date of birth. So you can select your pile based on uh, the tarot card, the uh, date of birth or the color of the candle. In case if I like she can I have some more way to choose this? So this is my favorite way. What I do is I take three pieces of paper. In each piece of paper, I write one pile number. So pile one, pile two, and pile three. Then I close my eyes and I say the question, Dear God, God is Archangels, in the next six months, what achievement or what milestone I am going to experience? Then I'll pick up any one particular piece of paper, whatever pile number is mentioned in that piece of paper will be the pile that I will be looking at. So you can do the same as well completely up to you. So I've given you four ways of choosing a pile. Go ahead. There is no right or wrong. All right. So let's get started with today's reading. Hello pile one. How are you guys doing? I hope you're fine and rocking as always. Today we are going to see what achievements or what milestones are you going to experience in the next six months. So if you've chosen this pile based on your tarot card that is a chariot or the pink color candle or on the basis of your date of birth then uh, this is the pile for you. Do not worry if any of the particular option that you have chosen is not something that you are drawn to us. For example, you are drawn by the date of birth but not by the candle. Any, either or is okay. Alright, so let's get started. I'll keep the date of birth over here. But if you are not belonging to any of this date of birth, do not worry. I'll, alright. So this pink candle is telling me that your milestone or your achievement is going to be in your personal life. This is something that you, you absolutely love to do or you have been truly praying for it. Uh, it could be love, it could be friendship, it could be a reconciliation. Alright, 
so how how achievement can be a reconciliation well at times when you reconcile with someone okay this is just not when you reconcile with someone you start growing right okay so you have chosen the chariot card so you are someone who has achieved things in life via hard work you have really given your best and you are a self made person every achievement of yours has been a work of perseverance discipline and consistency let me keep your card over here and now let's see what other achievements or milestones you are going to experience or attain in the next 6 months I see the word contract so maybe signing of some document or paperwork I feel that there is some paperwork or something that you have been really trying to uh get your hands on since some time but it's some it's somehow not happening all right let's see your first achievement or milestone wow ace of cups so i did tell you that with the pink candle i see this achievement more towards your personal life so the achievement that you are going to have is a new beginning in your personal life it could be a marriage if you're single it could be um a child if you have been praying for a child or or maybe your children are going to bring in those moments of achievement and pride into your life wow this is this also refers to a new beginning something that you have been praying and hoping for the next achievement or milestone you are going to have is knight of pentacles so this card clearly means that you are going to you have been working on something since the past few months and uh, whatever it is that you have been working on uh it is like really giving you a slow and steady results okay you are you are getting results but not what you have been truly wanting uh towards so i see that in the next 6 months there is going to be this progress which you have been hoping and praying for and even if this progress is taking time it will happen okay uh, i also feel stability okay i also now when i'm seeing this two cards okay this hand is offering a cup and he it looks like this hand is offering a cup to this man right so and he is so proudly and peacefully looking at this cup so i feel that this is you and this is divine so this i also feel there is going to be some sort of award or reward that you are going to get you may win some contest also uh uh not not please understand many people watch this uh video so take what resonates and leave what does not so i feel with the way these two cards are facing each other you are going to receive some sort of award um for sure with regards to work award or appreciation all right let's see the next achievement or milestone you have got the nine of wands so uh the next you have been really working hard towards something and in the past you did the same thing and you were not able to succeed however this time you are going to succeed all right that's the milestone i also feel you're going to overcome your past traumas all right so as i said when i look at your cards the achievement looks more like personal okay than um it looks more to do with personal aspect of life than a professional aspect but with the knight of pentacles a professional aspect is covered as well or finances is covered as well but it looks like okay there's one more uh 
or one more narrative over here something that you have lost in the past you're going to achieve it okay something which was taken away from you uh, which you truly deserved you're going to receive that again so when i look at your cards the achievement that i can milestone that i can clearly see is rewards and recognition um, milestone with regards to finances okay uh, receiving award i said that and something which you were denied in the past you are going to receive that again all right now let me see your other cards i have already removed them so uh, i do have a whatsapp broadcast list in case you want to be a part of that broadcast list then you can uh, click on the link given the pin comment all the comment all the links are in the pin comment you can have a look at it also my book prayer magic miracles is on kindle and on amazon you can have a look at that as well let's see your milestones you have got the world so you're going to reach more people okay world represents success okay so you're going to receive more success you're going to reach more people more people are going to come to know about you the kind of person you are as well i also feel you the milestone that you're going to achieve is with regards to travel as well now you may you may ask you what is a big milestone with travel yes when uh, you travel to a place which you always wanted which was in your bucket list that also turns out to be a milestone so yes some of you are going to travel and that's going to be your beautiful milestone out there let's your next card happy success wow so look you know success can be of two types you can get success and it will come with stress okay or you can have success which may come with frustration however over here you have got happy success which you know which again now this is uh, summarized by this two cards the ace of cups and the knight of pentacles so success which is happy success which is the reward of your consistent past efforts you have been truly giving your best but somehow you're not been able to get the success that you you truly deserve and that has been quite disappointing for you let me keep your card over here the card of happy success let's your next card surrender to wonder and awe so this is a, available to you okay this kind of achievement and milestone is available to you however you because of your past experiences because of um the past experiences you have become very skeptical you like I, i'm not sure if i can actually receive this achievement or milestone so don't let your past define your future surrender to wonder and awe and believe that awesome things will happen to you okay i keep this card over here let me just push this card a little up okay all right let's see your next two cards oh you have got poverty and community now this is an achievement a milestone so clearly you're going to help lot of people you are going to get support from the community now look over here this boy over here looks this boy over here right in this card the both both the boys look similar so clearly i feel that you want to do lot of social work you're going to really help people come up in their life and that is also an achievement when you help uh when you help people that's an achievement too that's a milestone too in your life and you're also going to get support from a lot of community your if you are a social media influencer or if your work involves you requiring a community of people supporting you then that's going to happen as well now let's see what your tea leaf cards are going to tell us in case you want to know what decks i have used the time stamp is below have a look at it take the cards
Alright, I'm going to take this one as well. Okay, now let's see what are going to be your achievements and milestones. Okay, we'll see all of it one by one. Financial pinch. So, just like the uh, Nine of Wands, it talks about some pinch which you had faced in the past, which is kind of made you skeptical. So, you are going to be able to overcome that financial pinch. I also feel with this poverty and community card, the ones who are experiencing financial pinch, you are going to help them to overcome that pinch, thus leading to a lot of support and blessings coming your way. I also feel you are going to get rid of the financial pinch that you have been experiencing in the past and that's going to be a milestone. That's why you have got the card of happy success over here. Funnel, period of frustration, lessons to be learned. So, with this, I feel milestones also happens with regards to the learnings, okay? So, uh, in the past, with the nine of, we you know what? I can also see one more angle over here. So, in the next six months, even if you face any problem, all right, you are going to learn your lessons and overcome all that problems. Isn't that awesome? So whatever the period of frustration is going to be in the next six months, you are going to overcome it beautifully and you are going to make that success uh, via turning an adversity into an opportunity. That's why it is a happy success. Okay, let me keep your card over here. The next achievement is pay attention to your health. So you are going to pay attention to your health and you're going to correct all the issues that you have been ha experiencing in the past. Again, with the nine of wands, this resonates. So, you know, earlier you were not like paying attention to your health because of uh, being very busy however lately you have been conscious about your health you really want to kind of take proper action and that's going to happen as well not unsuccessful plans so whatever plans that were unsuccessful in the past you are going to turn it into a happy success all right Keep it over here you got November, so uh, November is going to be a very important month in which you're going to achieve your milestone or maybe you'll start your milestone. You are on the road to success and look over here, you got, you now look at this, happy success. So when I'm looking at your cards, one more story I can see, okay, with your tarot cards. It looks like you were really trying hard, okay? You were really trying hard to uh, go ahead, but you were faced with a lot of financial pinch and frustration and an unsuccessful plan. However, you kept on going ahead. You did not give up. You were like, I'll not give up. I will keep on putting those consistent efforts. And that's going to give you rewards in the next six months, okay? This is also what I can clearly see from your cards over here i'll keep it over here okay let's see your next card you're on the road to success a marriage will take place either romantic or business wise so there is going to be this partnership that is going to lead to success as i said when i picked up your pink candle that yes there is going to be a personal uh, happiness joy as well a personal milestone at the same time uh, you will also get the support you may tie up with someone and who can really help you to grow ahead looks like a young person over here a young trustworthy person a just friend is thinking of you so there there is some sort of opportunity that a distant friend will discuss with someone maybe like for a job or maybe for a, uh, for work purpose or maybe the person distant friend will refer you to this person which will lead to opportunity and happy success wow isn't that awesome group one 
So clearly, in your case, the milestone is going to be rewards, recognition, uh, uh, rewards for your past efforts, especially. I also see there's going to be a personal milestone with the Ace of Cups. Could be uh, birth of a child, addition to the family via marriage. Okay, the ones who are like, oh, Sheetal, I don't want to marry. I'm already married or I already have children, then some uh, good news coming your some milestone achievement of your partner or your child, that could be one as well. Okay, now let's see what your Wheel of Fortune is going to tell us, group one. So think about a question and let me spin the wheel for you. You have got soon, so whatever you have asked, the answer is soon. All right, group one, I hope you enjoyed this reading as much as I did. If you did, do hit the like button to subscribe to my channel if you are guided. I am there. I, we have a, a community on WhatsApp as well. You can be a part of that communicate community receive a lot of rituals i'm there on instagram as well you can join me on instagram and yes my book prayer magic and miracles is out now a book which has got 82 prayers in it covering all aspects of life it is available on kindle as well as on amazon all the links are in the pinned comment take care bye bye Hello my lovely angels, how are you guys doing? I hope you are fine and rocking as always. This is Sheetal Sapan Matri, welcome to my channel and today we are going to see what, what achievements or milestones are you going to have in the next 6 months. So if you've chosen this pile based on your date of birth, okay, which is this or based on the candle or based on the a uh, six of wands card then this reading is for you all right don't worry if you have chosen the pile based on the color of the candle and not on the date of birth whatever you have chosen let's go ahead and see it okay so the first thing that i can see over here is i'll keep your date of birth out here the first thing that i can see is that you have chosen a green candle so definitely the milestone is going to be, uh, this is a green beautiful candle. So the milestone is going to be on, with regards to health, okay, emotional health, physical health. Of course, you need to see the doctor and take the right medication. So uh, the, the achievement is with regards to health and finances getting better. Is what I'm getting with the candle that you have chosen okay and let's see the six of wands so you have chosen the six of wands card which means there is going to be this achievement the success that you have been dreaming of you have been really uh, wanting to experience this success however it was kind of getting delayed but soon you're going to experience it let me keep your card over here now let's see what your other cards are going to tell us with regards to your achievement in the next six months or milestone in the next six months. Milestone one. Milestone two. I feel that you're going to set a lot of boundaries and not let people walk over you milestone three okay let's see your cards one by one you have got the pentacles two of pentacles which means the milestone that you are going to have in the next six months is going you're going to handle two projects okay if you are into a business uh, then it could be two businesses if you're into a corporate career you would be handling two projects uh, if you are a homemaker or if you are a retired person or student, you are going to really do amazing multitasking resulting in huge achievements. Like you're going to be so proud of yourself. So you're going to be super proud of yourself with regards to the way you're going to manage this two different things. At the same time, you're going to manage your finances pretty well. 
and this managing of finances is going to lead to huge growth in terms of money okay money getting multiplied all right this is beautiful let's see the second achievement the second achievement that you are going to have is in with regards to knight of wands now knight of wands is the fastest among you know of course second fastest to the knight of swords but it's one of the fastest knights all right so the knight of wands talks about movement growth so you are going to have this amazing growth in the next six months in your life especially with regards to your finances is what i'm getting i also feel just like group one you're going to travel to amazing places and that's going to be your an achievement as well okay traveling is also an achievement because it requires planning investment all right let's see your next card for some it could be a relocation as well with regards to knight of wands that's the achievement the next achievement is six of pentacles so if you were confused between group one and group two i think you should see group one as well because there was a similar aspect the six of pentacles talks about charity so you are going to do a lot of charity in the next six months and that's going to be a very important milestone for you i also feel some of you are going to pay off your loans okay um pay off any pending amounts that has been haunting you uh, i also feel with this card the achievement going to be is getting rewards for your past efforts again just like group one all right so you have got two pentacle cards so clearly the achievement is going to be with regards to finances there's no doubt about it all right now let's see what your other cards are going to tell us i have already removed your oracle cards okay here we go All right, so these are your oracle cards. Let's see them one by one. Woman holding a heart. So this talks about the achievement over here is being so generous, okay? Like the six of wands, being so generous that your generosity is appreciated by people. Your generosity is rewarded by others as well. I feel that a woman with a big heart is going to either give you some sort of reward or appreciation in the next uh, six months. Also, she is holding this heart as if, you know, she's, she has got this as a reward. So, definitely even you will get some sort of reward and it could be like, um, you know, like a popularity contest, like example, uh, somebody doing a popularity contest and you getting a reward as being the most generous the most uh, lovable miscongeniality that kind of award all right or it could be for some people it could be uh, you know how youtube has got its uh, own uh, diamond and all that you know golden and diamond tabs that they give okay button button so it looks like that to me as well for few but clearly a reward i feel that you're going to receive a lot of love and appreciation from uh, people okay i i also think that let me push your cards up okay you have you have been really a generous person however you've not been getting the appreciation for your generosity not that you're looking out for appreciation but you feel that there should be some sort of acknowledgement right and that has been missing in your life that also you're going to receive so that's a milestone as well so apart from finances and travel and charity one of the milestones that you are going to have is a lot of appreciation from a woman okay uh, or a lot of love coming your way you have got courage 
So you're going to be really, with the Knight of Wands, you're going to be courageous and you're going to move ahead. You're not going to look back and you know that's also achievement when you uh, keep on going ahead with discipline and consistency. So that's one of the achievement that you're going to experience. Let's see what you need to surrender. Surrender to your intuition. So your intuition is going to give you the right guidance as to how you can tap into this energy and you know multitask and bring in that amazing amount of financial inflow. So surrender to your intuition as it's going to really guide you and help you to grow. You have got despair and child. So for some, it would mean that with regards to addition in the family, there has been a lot of desperation or maybe you're really worried about your child. You're like, you know, uh, why are they behaving this way? Why are they not behaving in a particular manner? So you, are, you will be able to overcome that despair. It also means that your child will make you proud. All right. The child can also mean new projects and new beginnings. So that's also indicated. So there could be some sort of new project that you have been really trying hard, but you have just faced despair and failure. However, now you're going to experience the uh, benefit and the growth. All right. Now let's see what your tea leaf cards are going to tell us with regards to your achievements. Okay, one just fell. Let's take that. Okay, we have this two cards. Let's take one more. Okay, this went back in. Okay, two cards came. Alright, okay, let's take all of them and let's see what what story we can get with regards to your achievement. Okay. Misunderstanding. So there was some sort of misunderstanding that you were experiencing in the past. And the achievement is going to be that you're going to break this wall and resolve this misunderstanding. Okay. Or maybe somebody had a misunderstanding about you and because of which you were not getting the growth and the appreciation before. But now that misunderstanding will get resolved. The wall that is there between you and appreciation is going to get uh, been diminished and you will receive the appreciation family sorrow so in the past you know, again look over here you know now this is talking about the child and despair okay and the weeping willow talks about family sorrow so this is again resonating so this clearly means that there has been some sort of sorrow with regards to family and that's uh, and you, you, you know, you have been finding it so difficult to process it. However, you will be courageous and you will overcome that, uh, that family sorrow or that family, uh, if you are a part of a toxicity from a family member, you want to set those boundaries and that's going to be an achievement, right? Okay, let's see your next card. The month of the year, you got June. So some, so you one of your milestones will be achieved in the month of June. All right, let's see the next card. Great and good fortune. So you're going to just, you know what, with the six of pentacles and the great good fortune, I'm not surprised. Okay, so there is going to be this financial windfall and this great fortune that you are going to receive because of your past efforts and you not giving up no matter what situation you were in. Deep personal strength and peace that assures success. Again, the courage card over here and this uh, talking about the same thing. So definitely, uh, since you have been showcasing, I can clearly see one thing, okay? You have been trying really hard to achieve something in your life, 
okay and it's just it was just not working out however you did not give up you have been really consistent and trying and putting that effort because of that consistent efforts and that personal strength and courage that you have shown that's going to assure the success that you have been praying and hoping for you got career so look i told you with this two of pentacles and six of pentacles card that you are going to experience an achievement in your finances and now with the career card i'm not surprised so yes you're going to achieve success in your career and your finances because of the the deep perseverance and the and the and the consistency and the not giving up attitude you've got successfully overcoming a problem so this despair that you were facing this family sorrow that you were facing you will be able to successfully overcome that problem keep your life in balance so you know over here the two of pentacles talks about multitasking and trying to balance things out so the achievement that you're going to have is you're going to be able to achieve all of this with a proper work life balance okay solid foundation success with effort now look at your my 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 wow this is so beautiful you have got the word success i think let me see once twice okay successfully overcoming a problem three times the word success showcased in your reading Oh, all right and you did get the great fortune as well so look over here okay successfully overcoming a problem deep personal strength and peace that assure success solid foundation success with effort so clearly what i see is that the efforts that you have put has led to a solid foundation and the consistency has kind of helped you to overcome a problem and will result in a short success you got great good fortune as well this is so beautiful so blessing is clearly career and finances and for some it is with regards to family okay if we have been trying to solve a misunderstanding with family or with regards to a child then that's applicable as well all right now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us group two think about a question and let me spin the wheel for you you have got a no so let's understand why is it a no right why is it not a yes it's always feel that no gives us more clarity okay now right. the reason you have got no is because somewhere emotionally you are not ready okay somewhere you yourself are blocking it somewhere you're not you feel that you don't deserve this okay so you're being a little bit naive or immature about it so a little bit of emotional wisdom will help you all right so you need to work on your emotional wisdom to get that no into a yes all right group two i hope you enjoyed this reading as much as i did if you did do hit the like button to subscribe to my channel and yes i am there on whatsapp broadcast uh, we we have a separate broadcast in which we share a lot of interesting stuff if you want to be a part of that you can click on the link in the pinned comment my book prayer magic and miracles is out with 82 powerful prayers we have already sold 500 copies and we are, we are there on kindle as well as on amazon so if you want to order the book prayer magic and miracles you can click on the link given the pinned comment as well all right group to share this with your friends and family so that even they can know what achievements they are going to have in the six months all right take care of yourself bye bye hello group three how are you guys doing i hope you're fine and rocking as always today we are going to see what achievement or what milestones you are going to attain in the next six months so you have chosen this beautiful world card or if you've chosen this orange candle or if you've chosen this pile on the basis of date of birth 
it's completely okay it does not matter on what grounds have you chosen this pile but what really matters is that this pile is meant for you so i'll keep your date of birth over here in this side now let's see your cards okay they've chosen this beautiful orange candle which means you really want a turnaround in your life you really want that good fortune and success that you have been truly 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 praying and hoping for it looks like you know you have gone through a spell of not that great luck and now you really are looking for great fortune all right i'll keep your uh, beautiful candle over here okay and this side now you've chosen this world card again you really want to have that complete overall success success not only in one aspect of your life but in multiple aspects of your life also i feel that you you really truly desire to reach out to more people all right and you really want to spread your wings now let me keep your card over here now let's see what your other cards are going to tell us if in case you want to know what decks i have used just check on the timestamp achievement one achievement two and achievement three so i'm kind of seeing a briefcase like a work briefcase so when i see a work briefcase i think money coming via work or right, money coming via career i also feel that um it's like somebody giving you money for your efforts but i see a briefcase okay like a work briefcase not like a travel briefcase okay now let's see your cards one by one the first achievement that you are going to have is two of wands which means that you are going to plan out the next six months so beautifully and you're going to achieve all of that also you are going to really make great choices that are going to lead you to further success that's going to be your achievement and milestone that is taking right decisions okay you are also going to collaborate with someone and that collaboration is going to be like a milestone it looks like you know you always wanted to collaborate with this person or you always wanted to work with this person and then you are going to get that opportunity in the next 6 months to actually work with this person that's your next achievement the sun so the next achievement that you are going to have or the milestone that you're going to have is with regards to success achieved via creativity you're going to be super creative and you're going to create something so amazing that that the world is going to take note of you the world means lot many people all right you're going to receive fame success uh in the next uh 6 months i also feel that with the world card and the two of wands and the sun card i see lot of traveling happening as well you may travel for work as well all right but this travel is going to be uh, like this achievement okay that you have been wanting for interestingly all the three piles had the same thing with regards to travel and achievement okay so yes that's over here that's your next card you have got the emperor so the next 6 months you are going to achieve power all right your your status is going to increase you're going to be more powerful you are going to be more uh out there more successful people are going to respect you you are going to achieve one after another lot of success all right and that success is going to make people take note of you all right so a lot of organization and planning happening in the next 6 months and this organization and planning will lead to lot of success as well more power coming your way that's the milestone 
so there could be a raise or promotion as well or there could be this increase okay uh, in power all right now let's see what your tea leaf cards are going to tell us i also remove your other cards which have already removed This green card is kind of all right. Let's see all of these cards one by one and understand what achievements and milestones you are going to have. So, uh, group three with you, I feel it's work. The achievement is work based. Okay. That's your cards. You have got to keep your life in balance. So yes, with this achievement that you're going to have, you're also going to maintain your life in balance, which means you're going to take care of your personal life as well. And that's an achievement. People are going to be like, oh my God, this is so amazing. This person is managing both his, his or her personal and professional life so well. So that's an achievement. I also feel the scales, uh, you're, you're going to get rewards for your karma you got coins money will be coming to you so that's a milestone wow a lot of wealth coming to you and that's going to increase your power and you know this emperor is holding a chess uh, a chess you know what is it called I think the, the chess emperor, right? So uh, definitely you are going to play your cards pretty well. It's going to lead to a lot of money coming your way. You got over here, someone you know is undependable and insincere. So the achievement is you want to identify people like this around you. And then you are kind of either going to remove them or you're going to ensure that they uh, scale up with regards to their performance and dependability. Okay. Right. You got trouble and accusations. So uh, it looks like, you know, there has been in the past people accusing you. Uh, it could be people saying that you are expensive or people saying that, okay, you know, whatever was offered, promised was not that great. Whatever these accusations or trouble were that people were kind of brewing against you, that's going to go away and they, the same people will be like, you know what, I know this person, I work with this person kind of uh, these people would now want to piggyback your success okay the month of the year you have got january so january is going to be super important for you you got love so along with the coins you're also going to receive the love that you truly deserve from people around you and they are going to really genuinely realize that how amazing you are and the difference that you have made in their life thus you receiving more love for singles it could be that you'll meet somebody interesting and that could be an achievement with regards to loving yourself enough that you manifest someone who truly deserves you the ones who are already married, uh, love can also mean love from a child, love from a spouse as well. You got over your broken bridge, an unsuccessful outcome to a problem. So in the past, you were constantly facing this lack of success. You're not able to figure out what the problem was. And since you were not able to figure out the problem, you were not able to fix it, right? And uh, then, and because you were not able to fix this problem, there were certain accusations or trouble that you fell into. That is going to get fixed, and this bridge is going to get uh, built, and this there will be this successful outcome to a problem. Romance celebration party. So uh, again, with the love and romance, I am not surprised. 
so there is going to be your love life is going to be full of uh, love and happiness uh, and achievements as well you and if you're already married or you are in a committed relationship you and your partner will celebrate an important milestone okay uh, it could be a joint milestone and you're going to be so happy about it for which you will even throw a party as well because of this achievement of yours all right now let's see what your other oracle cards are going to tell us i've already removed them you have got thinking women so again with the uh, two of wands card and the emperor card a lot of thoughts a lot of ideas are going to really lead to huge success all right and these ideas are going to really change the course of your life i also feel an achievement for few would be a book that you're going to write okay and this uh, book could be could be lead to a great success i also feel with this thinking woman card that you are going to come up with ideas that are going to bring in lot of money all right also achievement with regards to education rest and rejuvenation again you had got the card of scales okay so you're going to achieve a lot of things in life however not at the cost of lack of rest and rejuvenation i also feel with the rest and rejuvenation card that you are going to focus on your spiritual and mental health thus leading to this rest rejuvenation which will eventually lead to success new beginnings so clearly there is going to be the milestone is going to be with regards to new beginnings and this new beginnings could be literally a child or a new project and with the sun card i am not surprised so sun card represents love sun card represents um creativity child travel um uh, knowledge as well so all of that you're going to receive that's the milestone in the next 6 months a lot of new beginnings happening new projects uh personal life shining as well surrender to setting limits however you need to set healthy boundaries with the emperor card and not sur surprise all right you need to say no wherever you you cannot say a yes to don't be in your heart saying i don't want to do this and verbally saying a yes to it okay do not do that surrender to setting boundaries and limits you have got the lovers card oh my god you got love over here you got lovers and there was one more something to do with love okay where is it coins feather fan a uh, romance celebration party so clearly uh, your one of the achievements is going to be in your personal life all right with regards to love clearly love also means love from friends love from family love from a child okay so love in all forms you're going to receive a lot of love that's so beautiful so lovers it is you also got gift over here so the milestone that you are going to have is this gift for all the efforts that you have put in the past whether it was a personal relationship whether it was a professional relationship that's going to be a milestone the universe is going to give you huge gifts to appreciate all the efforts so when i look at your cards one achievement definitely is with regards to money okay money coming your way second achievement is identifying people who are uh, not contributing to your growth or to your peace and kind of i you know removing them or keeping a distance from them second is a love okay receiving love from uh, friends and family all right and uh, all one more achievement that i can see is you are a gifted person you're a talented person and you're going to get proper utilization of your gifts 
which will lead to more money coming your way. That's going to be achievement as well. So career is one aspect, love is one aspect and finances is also one aspects with regards to your achievement and also knowledge okay you're going to receive a lot of knowledge with the thinking woman as well all right now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us group three so think about a question and let me spin the wheel for you you have got between no and miracle okay so I feel that whatever you ask for, initially you might hear a no or in the past you have heard a no and now it will turn out to be a yes which will be a miracle. Alright, let me give, get a more further insight. Yeah, so in the past you, you re got really disappointed with this, like your heart was broken. However, now it's going to be a yes, okay. All right, group three, I hope you enjoyed the reading as much as I did. If you did, do hit the like button to subscribe to my channel. Do share this video with friends and family whom you think will benefit from this reading. Also, I am there on Instagram. I'm, I have a broadcast channel as well. You can be a part of the channel, receive various rituals and how the day is going to be from Monday to Friday. My book Prayer, Magic and Miracles is out. It has got 82 powerful prayers. We have already sold 500 copies and uh, it is available on Kindle as well. A prayer, 82 powerful prayers regarding every situation. All right, group three, take care of yourself. Lot of love to you. Bye-bye. So these are the decks that I use for today's reading. Tea leaf fortune cards. Kipper deck, energy oracle, and the light seer. The tarot cards that I used were light seer tarot, gold file tarot, and ethereal visions. Thank you, Jyoti, for this beautiful two decks. And uh, then we have power of surrender cards and quantum oracle. So these are the decks that I used for today's reading. Take care. Bye bye.